Welcome once again to Maths with Esol Novo. In this tutorial, we are going to propose a solution to this Maths Olympiad problem. If today is your first time, please consider subscribing so that you can get notified whenever I drop amazing video like this. So we have a function 5 power x plus 2 is equals to 4 power x plus 1. Our goal here is to find x to find x so when we have 5 power x plus 2 is equal to 4 power x plus 1 okay if you observe this is the base and 4 is also the base on the other side and they also have different powers so since the base 5 and 4 cannot be expressed in common base all we have to do here is just to take the logarithm of both sides. So if I take the logarithm of log of 5, x plus 2 is equal to log of 4, x plus 1. Good. The reason why we took the logarithm is that we know from the law of logarithm that whenever we have log of m to the power of n, that we can write it as n log m so since this is true we it allows us to multiply the power to the log so we multiply x plus 2 to log 5 and this is equal to x plus 1 to log 4 okay this is why this is the main reason why we took the logarithm of both sides so in that case we are going to use log 5 to open the bracket so we use log 5 to multiply everything inside the box so log 5 times x will give you x log 5 log 5 times 2 will give you 2 log 2 log 5 and that's equals to log 4 times x will give you x log 4 and log 4 times 1 will give you log 4. Good. So since we have this now, it's very simple. The next step we are going to take is to look at this two. Let's return it just like we have this log. So we have it that we have x log 5 plus, we can write it as log 5 squared. Yes, because since we multiplied, it's the same thing. And this is equal to x log 4 plus log 4 good then 5 squared is 25 so we have x log 5 plus log 25 is equal to x log 4 plus log 4 good then the next thing we do is to collect like terms to bring all the terms that have x in one side and all the ones that are just numbers to other side. So we have it that x log 5, then we subtract x log 4 from both sides minus x log 4 is equal to log 4. Then when log 5 crosses the equality sign, it becomes minus minus log 25. Good. So, in this place, we can now factor the common term, which is what? x. So, if you factor out x, we are left with, we are left with log 5 minus log 4, and it's equals to log 4 minus log 25. Good. Then, at this point, you can now see that we can... From the laws of logarithm, which says that whenever we are subtracting logarithm in the same base, something like this, that in the same base, that it is the same thing as we can divide the numbers in that common base. So, on knowing this law, we are going to apply it to this particular term. So, x is now into log 5 divided by log 4. And this is equal to log 4 divided by log 25. Good. So since on having this, you can now see that 
We have to, to find the value of x, we have to divide both sides by log 5 over 4 and divide both sides by log 5 over 4. So that log 5 over 4 will cancel out. So on having this, you can now see, you can now see that our x, our x is now equal to log, log 4 over over 25 divided by log 5 over 4. Good. So since we have this, we can now write this. Let's simplify here. We can now like write this to be to be expressing them to be in the same in a common log. So we use change of base. In that scenario, we can now have it to be that x is equals to Keeping the same base, we have it as log 5 over 4 of, of 4 over 25. And that's the required answer to this initial problem. If you found the video interesting, don't fail to like, comment, and share for more exciting math tutorials like this. Till your friend, Matt, meet. It's enough.